but you see classified the root canal system into eight types for the sake of remembering we can group them into three the first group is group one two and three all of them have single exit they have single exit through which the root canal is exiting so there is single canal throughout in type two there is in the beginning there are two canals which fuse together to create single exit so here it is one one here it is two one in type three in the beginning there is single canal which divides into two and then they fuse again together to form single exit so the form becomes one two one okay so for type one two and three there is single exit in another group that we are talking about type four till type seven all of them have in common that is they have two exits they have two exits so to classify them the type four there are two canals throughout in the beginning also there are two and in the exit also there are two canals in type five in the beginning there is single canal but later on as it reaches the exit it becomes two canals so it becomes one two then comes type six in type six in the beginning there are two canals these two canals are there they are fusing together and by the time of exit they again become two separate canals so it is two one two in type six and in type seven we have single canal which and in type seven we have single canal which divides into two then it joins into one and then again it divides into two so it is one two one two pattern is there and the last one that is type eight it has three exits and it also has three openings also so there are three separate canals in type eight so this is the classification system given by what you see